We're gonna get started in like two minutes, almost there. All right, motherfuckers, how you doing? Uh, this is a very chill. I'll tell you why. Hang on. This is a very chill uh, game stream tonight. Uh, there we go. Because uh, you know we have this interview coming up uh, tomorrow with Good Sir Cliff Blazinski. Uh, however. Uh, I was just talking to him right now, and we might actually reschedule. We might not. We'll see. Uh, depending on if uh, we can get a little more time with him. Tomorrow we can only get an hour, which means we probably wouldn't be able to get to phone calls. So uh, we'll see. But right now, yeah, today is... Uh, I've been trying to get a bunch of stuff done and prep for tomorrow and prep for another interview coming up. So tonight... Uh, I am going to do from an hour and a half stream. This is going to be, uh, what is this thing called? This is Empire of Sin, which, so I started playing this primarily because, uh, John Romero is coming on the stream in, uh, in hopefully in a couple of weeks. Um, and this is his company. Him and his wife have this company, Romero Games, and she was the director of this title, uh, and the lead designer, and he was one of the designers, he was the producer, head of the studio, and he was also, I think he did some audio programming on it. So I'm like, well, let me see what these guys are making. I usually would not play a game like this, only because I'm conditioned to assume I won't like them. Things like Tropico and all that stuff. But as I played it, and yes, it is on Game Pass, so there was no barrier of entry for me. Um... I just, I, I, you know, I loved Jagged Alliance, if you remember that game back in the day. It's an old game. Brenda Romero worked on that game. She was the designer on that game. And there's a lot of similarities between that game and this game with um, a little bit of uh, uh, sort of uh, kind of the meta aspects to it as well. So I'm digging it. I really like it. I think it's fun. Um, it's addictive. And the setting of sort of 20 Chicago with the gangsters and all that, it really absolutely does uh, set the table really well. It really is a great immersive simulation that feels like you come to care about your characters, you don't want them to die. I just took down my first mob boss, so I'm a mob boss, and uh, I went after her safe house, and I just killed her, and I killed all her people, and now I have her safe, ho safe house because I'm trying to take over this one whole neighborhood. Uh, with all my shit. And so I'll show you. I don't. I have no idea. I have no idea how a game like this is going to stream. 
I don't know if it's a good streaming game or a bad streaming game. I can just tell you I know it's a good game. And um, I'm digging it a great deal. So hopefully you guys will see it. And if you have Game Pass, maybe you'll give it a shot. But I dig it a lot. Obviously, when John comes on, we're going to talk about this. But we're also going to talk about... Excuse me, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, his legacy. We're going to talk about his new stuff. We're going to talk about... Uh, all kinds of stuff. Same with Cliff, uh, if we talk to Cliff tomorrow. So anyway, this is, uh, this is, um, I keep blanking on the name. This is Empire of Sin. Uh, and you guys do me a favor. Let me know how the volume is treating you. So at this moment, um, so oh, I'll, I'll show you what, let me, let me get my dudes outside. Hang on. I'll show you all my guys. Uh, so... And what's cool about it, what's cool about it too is, um, you got it, boss. there is a real, you know, there are scenarios and sort of story-based scenarios that happen in this game. And then there's kind of like, there's, a, there's three types of missions, right? There's sort of, you're building your empire missions, which are things more like, you know, eliminate a minor faction, uh, control one neighborhood. These are just things that kind of bring you to the top of, of running Chicago. Then there's sort of story missions, um, which are more, you know, multi-layered, longer, and actually are sort of scripted and written. And then there's these little uh, side missions. So, for example, right now, um, I've had to go out and get a car battery because one of my gangsters that's on my team, which I call Untouchables Era De Niro. Um, hello, Andre. Good to see you, sir. Um, cause he kind of looks like De Niro. I mean, they, you know, I've given them all names based on sort of what they look like in culture, but he has a friend who just got hung by the police. He's dead, but they wanted to go get a car battery to try to bring him back to life. That's the truth. The game is not wacky like that, but that was kind of the first time I've ever seen, um, that sort of scenario in a game like this that up until now has been very sort of cinematic gangster accurate. Uh, this is Rosario Dawson, obviously, because she looks just like Rosario Dawson. Uh, this is Carmen Sandiego. Uh, this is Wonder from the book as a grown-up. I couldn't come up with anything for this guy's face, so if you ever read the book Wonder. But he's currently a mole in a uh, uh, another mobster's empire. Uh, this is Agent Coulson, because he kind of looks like, you know, the guy from S.H.I.E.L.D. and Marvel movies. This is my dude. I couldn't name my dude. You can't name the mob boss that you pick. You could be Al Capone in this game. Uh, but I picked this guy, Daniel Lucky Jackson. Um, and I had Kate Capshaw, and I had, um, hello Frank, and I had uh, some other woman. And uh, both of them just died when I took over my first uh, mob boss, right? I just, I killed her. It was very exciting to go after a, uh, a mob boss. So, so right now we're going to go after Retrieve the Body at Sexy Time Palace. So Sexy Time Palace is a brothel that I have taken over. And obviously you can name them. So let's see, I don't even know where I put it. That might be, no, that's that's an available building. I should go get that. That's, you bet your ass, that's a casino. That's cosplay and condoms. Uh, what do these guys want? They want alcohol. Yes, yeah, sure, you got it, pals. Uh, what do we got? Um, Oh, Al Capone was a moron, Frank? Really? I had no idea. So all these light blue buildings, these I think are mine? It's kind of weird. Am I the... Oh, right! Because, right, so I'm the uh, I'm the Vice Kings. So all these buildings are mine. There's Sweet Tooth's Tavern. But because I killed that lady, I got all of her uh, 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 land as well. And so you've got these neighborhoods, and you can kind of zoom all the way out. And I, I don't know if the ultimate goal, I assume, is to kind of run the whole fucking part of Chicago. But right now, and you can go anywhere you want right now, but right now I'm totally focused on just trying to sort of dominate this neighborhood. Hello, Fuzzy. This is um, Empire of Sin. And, uh, okay, so I'm looking for the sexy time place. That is right here. Let me select all my dudes. And then the weird thing is they make them walk. I'm not entirely sure why, like what the value of that is versus just sort of, you know, appearing there. But, you know, it, it, it is what it is. It is what it is. So they're going over right now to try to get the body that's being stored at the, uh, at the, uh, uh, what's that goddamn thing play? At, at the brothel. At the brothel. 
I'm gonna wait for my straggler to catch up. Where'd he go? There he is. Okay. So now we're gonna go inside. Why are they going over there? Okay. Yeah, you're selling hooch. You're upgrading hooch. This okay. is uh, you're selling sex. There's casinos. It's really cool. It's there's it's it's very it's a great. You have a really good sense of you know that sort of gangster life from the movies. I don't really know what the gangster life is like, but. All right, um, but it makes you feel like you're, you know, in a mob movie, which is cool. Okay, there's the dead body. Let's go see it. Bring the body back to life. Again, this is the wackiest mission they've had so far. Hello, Aquadronics. Good to see you too, buddy. Okay, he dead. He's dead. That didn't work. Return to Rocco. Okay, who the fuck is Rocco? All right. So that's De Niro. He says, I'm so ashamed. It's okay, you couldn't have known you can't reanimate a dead body with the car battery. Yeah, really? Really? So I'm kind of playing a nice guy, mobster. Um, I guess I'm disappointed I thought he could save him. I'm always trying to be nice, but I'll, I'll take over shit and kill people and shit. But I, I try to do the nice dialogue. You risk a lot for him, not everybody would do it. It took courage. So this guy will probably give me some... Uh, uh, thanks, boss. Sam's family gave me some cash for helping. I think you should have it. Thanks, Untouchables Era. Um, okay. I'd rather not take it, but I will. Okay, so now... Let's go do some combat. Hello, Weedy. Thanks for subbing, buddy. Uh, so we get all this shit. Oh, tank of oxygen. Okay. So now let's go do some combat, and then I'm going to start spending the money that we've earned. These are all the places I own, and Jesus Christ, now that I've got... I got all those, that lady's other shit. I don't know how I'm gonna be able to do this. But, we'll figure it out. But for now, let's go fight some, let's, actually, let's go get some gangsters. We have enough money that we can afford to get some new gangsters. So let's get, and you've got this notoriety score. So some gangsters will only work with you if your notoriety is high. I don't know why this woman who's great, Carmen San Diego, decided to work with me, but you know, there you go. All right, so she likes this guy. Let's see who he is. Uh, what's he do? Oh, he's good at demolition. Let's see. Hmm. I don't really have a lot of demolition shit, though. <coughs> nah, fuck this guy. Fuck him. Sorry, pal. I want to look at this guy. This lady's pretty cool here. Where'd she go? The, uh... That lady here. Yeah, these are the ones I've, that have died. The, Lisa, here. Here. Capone had syphilis, says Frank. I'm going to finish my bagel in a second. I know it's gross to eat on stream. It deteriorated his mental capacity to the point towards the end. He wanted everyone to call him Snorky. Really? Oh, my. My. What a moron. How did he end up dying, actually? What killed him? Fuzzy, uh, yeah, uh, yeah, it's totally like the Olive Garden Aqua. Fuzzy, it's basically, okay, she's a great shooter. Con artist, I don't, I don't, this is where the games like this kind of get me a little confused. Like, I've, I'm overwhelmed with choices, like, which one do I pick? So, fuck it, I'm just gonna pick her. Uh, cause she's got good shooting, and so far in this game, I've been shooting a whole hell of a lot. Oh, he died from syphilis. Fuck you, Bukaki, fuck, fuck. All right, let's hire her. She wants, oh my God, she wants $12,000. And fuck you, that's almost all my goddamn ducats. I don't want you. No, fuck off, I'm not doing it. I need some, I need some affordable fucks. Hello. Hi, how are you? You seem very mild mannered. Why are these guys so expensive? And you have to build their loyalty. And uh, morale. All right, bagel's done. I just finished it. Um, interesting. Why are these expensive? Sure you did, Bukaki. You broke Al Capone's heart. Fuzzy. So I went in and I named all the characters after um, 
things I could remember, whether they were celebrities or, or, or characters based on games or movies. So yeah, Carmen Sandiego was based on, because she looks like Carmen Sandiego. Oh, Bukaki totally broke Capone's heart. But see, this guy's cheap and you get what you goddamn pay for. Fuck it, we're taking the lady. We're taking her, we're getting one gangster. And you know what? Ooh, she's cool though. Ooh, she's pretty cool too though. Because she's got snipers, she's a doctor. Let's see what this lady is. Handguns, melee, sniper. Marksmanship's good though. Movement's eight. Movement six. Fuck it. We're going with this lady. Here we go, pal. Lover lost a significant amount of health. It's not my problem. Oh, is that her lover? Oh, shit. Is that the, the man she vibes with? Let's see. Uh, where is the lady? Here we go. Hi, boss. Oh, shut up, lady. I'm looking at your lover. Hang on. I don't... Oh, oh, she, she likes this guy. Ooh, that'll be a fun thing Hi, to see boss. what happens. Yeah, we're going to town, lady. All right, let's do it. Here you go. Hello, Maiku. Good to see you, buddy. You're good enough for me, Bukaki. It's not me. It's Al Capone, man. Reporting for service. Okay, what I talent? Okay, so then, then they have all these talents they can learn. Um, they've already got, the ones that are experienced all have a bunch of them already done. You're good at keeping a low profile, uh, so half full cover. This uh, you don't trigger. Oh, that's a good one. No Overwatch trigger. Uh, you throwing weapons are now coated with poison. Oh my goodness, well, that's a good one. We'll take that one. Okay. Wonderful. Uh, I'm totally a mob boss, Aqua. I tell you what, this game absolutely lets me, you know, live out those uh, fucking fantasies. Okay, so we're gonna close it, but I'm gonna go back to her because I gotta change her name. I will name her. What are we gonna name her? Uh, rename. Thank you, Victor, for subbing, buddy. I appreciate it. And thank you, Shay. Okay, let's see. I will call her. Um, who was that lady in Battlestar Galactica? The Asian lady that was really pretty. Um, we'll call this lady Kim. Oh, how about this? Kimono. Uh, what's this game's MO? What do you mean, Maiku? Kimono Killa. Killa with an AH. That makes it more street and cool. Right? What is her name? Grace somebody? The one in Battlestar Galactica? Um, Shuxi McGee? I'll get a Shuxi McGee, but she ain't it. She ain't it. All right, let's get her some goods in her hand there. Uh, I'll give her... I need to, Let's go to the black market, see what we can afford. I spent all my money on her. Um, okay, he's selling... Uh, let's get some badges. Bandages, sorry. So let's give her some of this. Do we have a vest? Do we have any vest available? Oh, we have this one. Okay, so now she's got a vest. better okay okay uh oh what's the game about it it is my coup it's kind of a um <laughs> that's right bukaki it, it, it it's 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 got rpg elements it's got tactical combat i'll go get into some combat in a second i'll show you and it's got kind of like management stuff like you know you're managing your alcohol uh, like, for example, I don't have much money right now. I just spent it on that lady. But in a second, I'll have some more. And uh, the, here's Hogwash's Hole. Hogwash's Hole is, is almost maxed out with upgrades. Uh, the Overlook Hotel is my hotel. Sexy Time Palace. So the ambiance in Sexy Time Palace is going up. Um, you can improve the quality of your alcohol as well. So let's see. Hogwash's Hole is selling, I think, whiskey which is the best you can get. Um, let's, I want to see what these guys are selling. Um, 
I have played Wasteland 3. The newest one? Oh, is great, Eddie T. Okay, where do I set the alcohol? Where you can make what kind of alcohol they're making. Hang on. Stolen Brewery Alcohol Quality. Okay, we're going to upgrade the alcohol. All right, now I have no money. And there is a point where if you spend too much money, um, you start not being able to pay your people. So, they want us to go to war with the White City Circus. Okay, let's go to war. We'll do it. Let me get let me get some let me get some shit for it though. So, what do I want in exchange? Um, I will take their safe house if we win and I will take um, I will take their what do I want? They have a they got to have a, a a place to drink. Let's take Oh, they got sexy time places. We'll take the star spot. We'll see if he agrees. Here we go. Right. So, so then what you do, you can zoom out, you can find the places uh, where war will be happening, and it's probably not in our neighborhood, so we have to take a cab, but let's see. War has been declared, so let's see. Uh, where is the war? Where's the war at? Where's the war? Talk to the bartender. Uh, well, I want to go to war first. I want to kill some people. Then we'll go back to that mission. Um, Real-time strategy, um, it's more like commandos or desperate. Oh, 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 okay, good. I thought we lost him. After being left in a brothel, Agent Coulson has earned the nickname The Heater. No, I, uh, it, it's more like commandos or Jagged Alliance or, or something like that. Hello, Mon. Okay, these guys want a grand for whiskey. You got it, pal. You can have some of my whiskey. All right, where's Agent Coulson? Is that him? All right, let's go. Where's, where's the kimono lady? So where's the war happening? Is it over here? Is it over here? You'll be able to recognize it by a little guns. I don't, that's the only problem with this is when you zoom out really wide, I don't know how to find what I need. These are all mine. I'm, I guess we're the... No, we're not the card sharks. We're the vice kings. Um, how do I find that? Little Italy, maybe? No. Maybe I have to... What's happening? What? What happened? Oh, we went downtown, baby. Okay, war has been declared. Reagan's cults have joined the Northside mob. Card sharks have joined. Okay. Oh, now now that war is declared, we can see where the battles are happening. Okay. At least I think we'll find out. Promote an underboss. Okay, I will. One second. Can I do it? Oh, maybe it just wants me to do the mission, but it's not telling me how yet. Okay. Oh, I have to be a 500 level. Okay. All right. So let me show you some combat. I mean, any of these places could be combat, but I'm literally looking right now for uh, where the war is happening. And I don't really know how to find that. It's it's a game that's a little... It kind of reminds me of like one of those... Um, 
one of those board games that's really complicated, but it's not. It just it's intimidating when you first get it. There was a recent war. Fuck you. I want to be part of it, man. Don't take my fun away. All right, fuck it. I'm just going to work on my own neighborhood then. I'm going to go back to my neighborhood. I'm going to try to keep taking it over. That's how we do it. That's how we do it in Chicago. Okay, so let's go after... Uh, we're Baby Blue. Let's go after... Thank you, Beagle, uh, Beagle Town. Let's go after the card shark shit. They're not going to like us, and fuck it. I don't care. We're taking, we're taking this shit over. Here we go. You know, all of you guys. The interface on this game is not bad, but it's not... It's a little, it's a little touchy. The reviews on this game, though, absolutely crazy, are terrible. I don't know why. Um, like, it got like a four on IGN and really bad reviews. Um, you've been playing Horizon Zero Dawn board game? How is it? I've been playing online on this thing called Tabletopia, which we're gonna start, we're gonna start doing with members soon. Hello, I'm old, fat, and balding. How are you, sir? Um, we're gonna, um, play this Tabletopia on the stream, uh, pretty soon. And, uh, that will be pretty good. Because you can play board games. It's, it's really, it's a good interface. Alright, here we go. Let us attack, wait, the card sharks. Huh, am I a card shark? Maybe I'm the card sharks. Who am I? I don't know the name of my game. That's the goddamn truth. Okay, these are me. I am I am the I am the vice king. So that I know. So why can't I attack the card sharks stuff? Maybe cuz I'm in a pact with them. What about these guys? I can attack these guys maybe. Thanks hybrid. Okay. I want I'm going to go going to find some way to fight. Let's just find a building and take it over. Fuck it. Thug o occupied racket. We're taking this shit over. God damn it. I'm itching for a fight, boys. Come on now. Let's attack. Are there xenomorphs? No. I'm pretty sure. All right, Fuzzy. Good to see you, man. Okay, so right now we have a 60% chance of winning this battle. Uh, you, it's weird. You can roll the dice and it'll just let you win or not. Oh shit, Rosario Dawson has no uh, has no armor. Um, but I don't quite know what the value of that is, but. I haven't, I've only tried that on battles that are like, you know, my henchmen out in the world where I'm like, fuck it, there's no way I'm going to win. All right, here we go. And you know, like all these kind of games, like Fire Emblem and stuff, you, you know, you get attached to your characters and... Okay, so we have a lot of guys to kill. I'm not too worried. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Okay, here we go. Hello, Tip Taylor. Good to see you. All right, so I am going to, here's my main guy. If I die, it's all over. Uh, he's got a couple of powers. He can literally break the weapons in the hands of the bad guys. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna break this guy's weapon. If I connect. I, I hit him, but I didn't break his weapon, okay. And I will say some of the moves I don't understand in terms of how much energy they take. Um, they're just not always that clear. Um, the emote with my headset. What do you mean? Hello, Peapod. Okay, here's my new lady. Let's see what she's got going on. She has a move where... Perform a melee using your secondary weapon. She can flush people out of hiding. She has overwatch. Uh, but I am going to go ahead and have her... What weapons does she have? Oh, she's a sniper rifle. Fuck yeah. Hang on a second. She's a sniper and a handgun. Let's just see what the handgun would do. That would almost kill that fucker. Uh, let's see what the sniper rifle does. Sniper rifle. 
That will kill him. Goodbye, good sir. Uh, oh, uh, Hutchinson Films. Good to see you, sir. Thank you, buddy. Hybrid. Yeah, man, it's really fun. I have been staggeringly addicted to this game the last three days. Here we go. Yeah, that's all she wrote. Bitch, you goddamn right you're done for. Here goes Rosario Dawson. She's got a move that can draw enemy fire. She's got a grenade. Let's see. Let's, let's deal with this guy if we can. What's cool is you can click on their weapons and, and kind of anything... Any weapon they have that will connect, it shows like this guy's 80% and then the red guys. So it, it it's actually, as much as I have problems with some of the user interface, um, it's actually really good too. All right, so let's see what this weapon's gonna do. Okay, this is a lower chance. That's a critical. I'm just gonna, I don't know. Fuck it, I'm gonna, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna take this guy out. Uh, or I'm gonna damage this guy, but hang on. Okay. Okay. Uh, I hope your night's going well. Loving the content. Thank you, Hybrid. I appreciate it. Yes, my night is going great. Uh, me and the kids, as soon as I finish up tonight, we're going to go to the dog park. Watch this guy die. Boom. Um, we're going to go to the dog park because my dog's crazy and has to go at night, but it's good. John Romero is coming on the stream. Uh, maybe next week or the next week. Him, him and I have already talked about it. Uh, there you go. Get Fuck you, bitch. Screen. Angles and point of view in, in, in strategy RPGs are awkward. Yeah, it takes a little getting used to. this. I love this guy. Coulson's great because he, he can go up to an enemy and literally he shoots them in the stomach. Um, and they start bleeding out. It's really nasty in a great way. All right, so I'm going to let these guys at this point... I'm going to put Coulson... Here. And then I'm going to put him into Overwatch. No, no! Wrong direction! Mm -hmm. Thank you, Carlos. Overwatch is if you run into their line of sight, you shoot them even if it's not your turn. However, mm -hmm. I didn't get a chance to rotate the cone of view mm -hmm. around. Don't shoot at De Niro. Don't shoot at Coulson. We will fucking cut you people up, motherfucker. Uh-oh. Ah. Good job, Carmen Saints. See, you get real attached, man. Uh, at least I do. Which is one of the things I love about this genre. All right, back to my dude. What is he going to do? Let's do... Let's take this guy out. Oh, that guy's a hot light? Wow. Fuck it. Let's do it. I did play Void Bastards, Tep Taylor. I, um, maybe I need to give it, hang on. Boom! Maybe I need to give it another try. But I remember just, I, you know, I wasn't, it, when I, when I played it, I wasn't in the world's best mood for a rogue. Um, and that probably is what it was that sort of made me go, eh. But yeah, I should, uh, I should give it a shot. Okay, let's try. Why is that 100%? But they're all red. Ooh, that guy will go down fast, but I want this guy. Okay, here we go. All right, sniper lady, let's do it. Oh, you coming to me, bitch? Really? You gonna come over to, to Kimono Jones? Fuck off. Fuck off. Oh, I'll take this guy, though. Oh, it's such a waste. No, I'm not going to waste her sniper abilities on that. We're going to take this motherfucker down. Here you go. Walking over, living back. Boom. Goddamn right. Now, now, this guy will once again put his... Who's after him? Oh, I'm off. Bound. Okay, no, no, no. That guy's next. I got to kill him now. So... Goodbye. Um. Albuquerque. <laughs> no, no, Peapod. That is not the plan. Um, it's been only real gamer pass surprise for me. It's been the only real gamer pass surprise for me. It's not so much a rogue when you play it. You keep everything but ammo, which is why I loved it. Yeah, I mean, I thought the art style of that game was amazing. Um.
Oh, and then this is a guy who's bleeding out right here. Um, but fuck him, I don't care. Yeah, fuck that guy. I'm the, I, I don't think I've given up on um, Returnal, but I definitely kind of... Hang on a sec. I definitely kind of lost my appetite for it. Um, not, not, I mean, I, I was obsessed with it, and I absolutely loved it. Um, but then I just got really busy with um, other games and prepping streams, and you kind of fall out of that um, cadence of it, and I'm sure I will go back to it. Like, I, I'm almost certain I will go back to Demon Souls, but Come on, you piece it, I'm gonna, there's a lot more to play before I probably go back to that game. I don't know, Peapod. I really don't want to make another twist. I don't want to make another video game right now. What I'm doing with movie games right now is, is just the right amount of involvement um, in video games at the moment. I am having too much fun doing this stuff that I'm really not kind of thinking about anything else. But I hear you. Okay, swap weapon. Yeah. Ooh. Oh yeah, I would, yeah, Eddie Torres, I would never even fathom to go after trophies in that game. Um, that, that, that's, that's way above my fucking pay grade. Yeah, champ. They're in the fridge, in the back. Yeah, thanks, buddy. Okay, let's snipe some fuckers, shall we? Aqua? I mean, I, I, you know, I don't know. I saw... I, apparently there was footage that came out today of Halo Infinite that was... Um, Leaked, but I didn't. I couldn't find it. Maybe they pulled it down. Um, there were some art that came out today. Um, hang on. Um, which I thought was cool. Um, oh, uh, uh, he uh, is that Arabic? I don't know how to read it, but thanks for joining, buddy. Um, as Esmolizdeha. Thanks for joining, bud. I appreciate it. Um, anyway, um, so, I mean, it looks pretty from the art they've released, sure, but I'm not like... Um, I I've never been a massive Halo fan. Will I play it? Yeah, because it's on Game Pass, but uh, I'm not like going, oh my god, I'm dying for it. But I'm certainly curious about it. I mean, yeah, I definitely want to... You know, I'm very much looking forward to the press conference coming up with Microsoft, just to see what they can do. And I've heard a, I've heard back, I've heard many, many different things about, you know, everything from keeping your expectations in check to, um, you know, they're going to have some really great stuff there. So I'm, I'm optimistic, I guess, about it, about Halo. Uh, no, god damn it, I didn't need to waste my bullets on that fucker. Um. Right, so now, now that guy's bleeding. Although, I think I just put Coulson in harm's way. Shit! I did. Alright, that's okay. Somebody go save Coulson. 
No problem, governor. Goddamn right. Goddamn right. Um, Novadamus, hey man, I created a turn-based, grid-based movement shooter for my student game. The most difficult part was trying to figure out how to handle the shooting without random... I mean, there's always a little random thrown in, right? I mean, you were trying to have zero random? I mean, at that point... I mean, at that point... I'm, I'm trying to figure out how good it would be without any random in there. Um, all right, who's left? That guy's left? Is that the last guy? Oh, he's the last guy. Fuck you, motherfucker. It's time to go. Um, oh, Aqua, yeah. It's a super exciting month as for playing games and for uh, just talking about them and learning new things and shit. Yeah, absolutely. Is she out of ammo? What the fuck's my... Oh, it's two. Okay. What do you mean he was all about agency? He was urging us to not have random. Oh, I mean, you, you need some, I mean, that's what percentages in these games are all about. I mean, otherwise, why not make, if, you, if you're gonna do that, just make a shooter game and make it skill-based. I mean, unless he was suggesting make a strategy game like chess that isn't random. I mean, that's, that's interesting. Um, but then the question really becomes, yeah, how do you judge the quality of the player at that point? Okay. Okay, I have to focus. Let me get over here. Okay, I'm gonna go right here. All right, buddy, sorry. Agent Coulson says goodbye. No, he's dead anyway. Let's get this guy. All right, Colson, let's do the deed. Oh, that's it. Looks like we got ourselves a brewery, boys. Oh yes, Yahoo! That's right. Okay. So we can destroy it, damage it. It'll be free, but um. I'm going to take it over. I don't have any money, though, to make it into anything right now. So I guess my only option, unless that money's coming my way pretty soon, if I smash it up, it'll be disabled. If I rinse, if I razz it... Okay, so we, we just took some shit, and now it's empty. And if I get enough money, I can come back and buy it. But I don't know if I have enough money. And what I like about it, too, is it's it's open-world-ish in the sense that, you know, you... Hang on, let's see what happens here. Yeah, so my money's going to start going up. That you really, you know, you're not overwhelmed by missions, but you absolutely can um, kind of kind of figure out your own you know, aspect of how you want to um, go down with your story. Okay, let's, let's go to this guy. I'm going back to Jaffe's Cave to talk to the bartender. Because that's kind of, um, there's something going on there. Where are we at? Where's Jaffe's Cave? Come on now. There we go. I'm gonna try to take over these guys. The Hip Sing Tong Gang. I think I can deal with. Hello, OKR. Gotcha. 
Okay. Alright, is this the guy we're talking to, or is he? Um, they'll give us brewery security upgrades less, speakeasy upgrades less. Um, in exchange for what? What am I giving them? Okay. Alright, who's this guy? Let's talk to this guy. Oh, he can be hired, but I'm not hiring anybody right now. This is the guy we need. Understood. Okay. We have a problem. What do you mean, never mind? I'm a nice guy. You see that drunk guy? His name's Herb. He's one of our regulars. Angel Angelo Gina's first cousin. He's a made man. Go home and get your shine box. Usually he doesn't bother people, but lately he's getting aggressive. He's staying later, drinking too much, picking fights. I don't know what to do, boss. People love him. But if he keeps us up, he's going to be affecting business. Hello, Edward Jordan. Hello, Connor. It goes good, buddy. Made man, don't worry. I'll handle it. All right. What are we going to do? Let's find out. Um, thank you, Sh Sh Shazad Noir. I appreciate it, buddy. Okay, where's the guy at the bar? Where you at, buddy? Is this him? Yeah, he's drunk as fuck. No, that's not him. It's this guy. There's Herb. Hey. What the fuck do you want? Calm down, you're okay. I hear your relative Angelo. Uh, I'll be nice. Are you feeling all right? I'm fine, never better. Herb, nice to meet you. It's a fine place you got here. Better than my fucking cousin Angeli Angelo. God damn it, Angelo Genius shitty diet. Why are you drinking here instead of your cousins? Or, um, I can't have you causing a scene. Uh, I'll ask, why are you drinking here instead? He's got shitty bars, I just fucking told you. I appreciate it, I'm afraid we're gonna have to do something about you, Herb. I can't have people coming to my business making a scene. What are you gonna do? I can use leadership skills to get him to not drink anymore. You're gonna have to leave. I can kill him. Or I could say, what the hell, you're not hurting anybody. That's going to hurt my business, though. I'm going to try to use leadership skills. Let's see what happens. And it succeeded. I've tried to always go back. Always, shit, I guess I could give it another go. What's the worst? Okay. So we completed the mission. My notoriety went up a little bit. And there we go. Um, so that's that mission. Let's see what else we can do next. I'm still trying to work through these empire... So side by side, I have to promote an underboss. I need my notoriety to go up. So what I'll do is, I don't know what a minor faction is. It's time to teach the wannabes a hard lesson. Take out a minor faction. Yeah, fuck it. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go after these guys. Um, let me, let me, let me upgrade some of my shit. Hey, Herb, quit the bottle. Herb gave up the bottle, and your patrons are happy you helped. So is Angelo Gina. Draw is permanently increased by 25% in your bar. However, as Herb predicted, he returned to the bottle and found himself passed on a railroad track where he was run over by a train. Aw, oh, man. Poor Herb. Okay, let's let's upgrade some shit. We got some ducats now. Then we'll go fight some bad guys. Um, okay, let's see what Hogwash is serving. Hogwash is currently serving whiskey. Rocky's Juke Joint needs to go up on whiskey. Stolen Brewery needs to go up on whiskey. And then Vice King is serving whiskey. So let's let's definitely fix our... Um, what's Cheater's Justice? I don't know what that is. Okay, we'll go to Rocky's Juke Joint. Let's improve the alcohol quality. Um, let's also... Let's fix some of our brothels. Let's fix cosplay and condoms. Let's add a little ambiance, shall we? That makes the... Co well, yeah, we'll add some... I don't know. We're about to go get in some fights and piss some people off. Maybe we need security. Now we're gonna... I don't know. I don't know. Let's see what they... Let's see. Uh, let's see. Let's do... Borat Sexy Time could use some ambiance and security. Da, da, da. Oh, Venus and Adonis. Shit, I own those now. It ain't easy being the boss, kids. Okay, um... Right, we're gonna upgrade the ambiance in the brothel. Um... Alright, now let's go fight. 
Let's just go fucking. F Actually, do we have any? Now we're good. Let's go fight. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go get in a gang war with these guys. This is the Sapphire Rose Casino. I'm gonna take over all the orange buildings. There's three battles if I win. Then uh, can I do it? Let's see. There's that one. That's small. These guys are minor. You guys are fucked. You guys are fucked. Jaffe's come to town, motherfucker. Goddamn right. Goddamn right. Why can't I attack? I'm just gonna go in and attack. Fuck it, I don't care. Let's see what happens. He wants a business agreement. Nah, fuck you. I'm gonna kill you. Things have changed. We can't work together. Fine. Fuck you. I'm killing all you motherfuckers. Thank you, King. I appreciate it. King of armatures? Like the animation things? Thank you, Andrew. Broke a treaty. Fuck you. I don't give a fuck. We're going to war, bitches. That's how I roll. Thank God I just saved the game. Okay, so let's find a guard to kill. And that will kick things off. Are there no guards in here? There have to be guards. Here's some. They're offering a gift. No thanks. You're going to hell. I want to fight this guy. Is this easier than managing a studio? Well, yeah, because nobody's dying in this one. Oh, no! Oh, no! My mole has been caught and executed. Oh, that sucks. Sorry, pal. Oh, well. No, let's fight! I wish people would stop wanting to team up with me. I want to kill you all. Oh, there we go. Oh my god, Jeff, what's happening? Right. No, fuck off. I want to kill your people. In this bar. I don't understand. There are some things about this game I just don't understand. Like, I don't understand why I can't kill... Why I can't get into a fight. Unless I happen to be, uh, kind of teamed up. Thank you, Mike. Unless I happen to be teamed up... With, um... This faction, and I don't really know it. Thank you, Kappa. Let's see. Maybe I am. I don't think so, though. Okay, so right now, we're neutral. But, Jaff, you mentioned once being a game test would be a good entry point. Having been a director, what do you look for? Oh, man, that's a conversation for, like, a proper stream. I, I would say, though... What, you know, I mean, I can tell you once... I haven't hired a tester in a long time. Hang on. Um, how do I kill these guys? Um, I can tell you once you're a tester... Um, no. Um, then, absolutely, you can... Um, It's easy to say, here's what you look for then. But before you're the tester... Oh, see that kicked off combat. I don't know why. Um, I don't know. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. But yeah, call in the next one, Mike. Uh, when we do calls at the end, I would love to answer that for you. I'll think about it. All right, so this is going to be a, a slaughter. We literally have two people. Y'all didn't have enough people. Y'all didn't have enough people. Guarding your goddamn shit. Goddamn right. What are we doing? Invite? Eh. Sure, why not? 
Alright, let's go. Going to war will cause them to target your safe house, rackets, guards, and crew. Are you sure? Yeah, fuck it. I'm in the mood. I'm feeling... I'm feeling frisky, baby. Ah, fuck you. That's the goddamn right. Damn it! One standing, buddy. What you doing? Well, sorry, pal. Fuck it, we're taking over. Can I afford it? Yeah, we'll make this. It's already a casino. We'll keep it a casino. We'll call this one. All right, we'll call this one in honor of uh, our mods. We'll call this is Bukakis, and the next one will be RPGs. Bukakis Casino, and it's casino with a K. You get it? You get it? I don't know if I spelled Bukaki right, but I don't give a shit. You know who he is. All right. Notoriety's going up. Almost we can upgrade our people. Okay, I accept. I'll join you. I want their safe house. I want their booze. And I want their... Okay. All right. So let's leave this building. I think. Uh oh, Al Capone's mad. There he is. Okay, so are we gonna own this building now? Yep, that became ours. Oh, there's a war in that building. Let's go kill that building. Uh oh. here baby come on now I mean I don't know man I don't know what it is about okay let's see so, uh, I think you should end your business arrangement come meet me yeah maybe I will but not right now yeah you're gonna have sit downs with the bosses I don't know what it is about this game that that has wrapped me up and it's 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 just it's just really fucking good it's really fucking fun 88%, but fuck it, I'm still going to war. All right. Oh, she's just outside. Okay, this is just her guard, okay. All right, well, sorry, sorry, champion. Let's see, what are we doing? That's 
off of you, champion. Oh, yes! Whoopee! Yippee! Oh, yeah. That's right. Yeah, in a lot of ways, that's why I want to ask John and Brenda about this game, because it's really ambitious, and I just wonder... As you wish. I wonder about that. I wonder about, you know, how big of an audience were they going for, because... Maybe people who like games like this are willing to sort of give it more time, but I know for me, I mean... It's not like it's hard to get into, but it's overwhelming at first because you don't really know what it is. And so I almost stopped playing. I'm really glad I didn't. I love this game. I'm on it. So she's in Overwatch now. If anybody enters that zone, she automatically shoots. Uh, oh, Carmen San... What? Carmen San Diego? She can't do anything? Why not? I'm going to put her... Oh. Hello, AGC. JC. We are just playing um, a little Empire of the Sin. All right, so they're both in Overwatch now. Now we'll bring out big bad Bob De Niro. Right there, baby. Come on now. And Agent Coulson. Let's put him right here. See that? Overwatch got him. Boom. Uh-oh. <coughs> Oh, she's running for the egg. Maybe not. Hello, balls. Oh, I get it. What's fun? Ah, it doesn't matter. They had him in Overwatch, god damn it. Shit. Get help. Ah. Right, so this should be their last stand. Oi! Fuck you, motherfucker! Don't fuck with Colson. I'll restart this goddamn game. You fuck with him. He, he's he's one of my good ones.
I'm seeing stars. Xavier Russell, thank you, buddy. I appreciate it, man. giant thank you buddy we only have one more is this a brothel what is it right now um arshia thank you mud um let's make it a speakeasy fuck it we'll call this one rpg's um drunken dad maybe that hit too close to home <laughs> sorry but i don't know it may not have I have no clue Okay, so now... Oh, wait, is this a brothel? What is this place? No, it's a... Well, it's a speakeasy now. Okay, so let's kill... We got one more orange building to take over. And I think we'll at least have that mission solved. Um, actually, I'm gonna move them all to right here so we give them some health. Donald Clinton, good to see you, bud. We're just playing this uh, Empire of Sin. And I'm about to heal my dudes. Let me take them down to this alley here. Look at these little, these gang members right here. Sometimes you get into fights with them, you can start wars with them. There they go. Okay, so I'm going to see if my guys have enough health. He's good, good. Fine, fine. Eh, eh, they're all good. Fuck it, let's go. We're going to war. We're going to war. All right. Looks like the cops are eyeing your businesses. To stop cops from casing your rackets, you can temporarily close them, or you can try to bribe. Them. All right, where's this dude diplomacy? Take him down. Okay. How do I bribe them? Oh, here we go. Bribe. Oh, so cool. Seven hundred dollars. Nice. Thank God. Okay. Okay. Now we have to fight outside the bar. We still got a good shot at winning, but fuck it. Okay. Gotcha. Kill him. So we just broke her weapon, so now she's not going to be able to harm us. 
this lady, who am I playing right now? That's the kimono killer. She has the sniper rifle. So let's have her go after. Let's see. Does she have the sniper rifle out? Yeah, she does. I forgot to have De Niro. <laughs> nice. All right, where are we going, buddy? It's too far. Okay. Goddamn right. Ha 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 funny. Wakagi, did you see we named a bar after you? Come on, man. You got your own bar. <laughs> named in John Romero's latest uh, latest uh, uh, masterpiece, sir. Uh, what's what she, he's gonna do? Light him up. Uh, big deal. If they mark you, you they take more damage, but it costs a move or a point. So he might. Uh, I guess they marked. Uh, they marked both of them. Oh, is this my guy? Oh, this guy's some random dude. Fuck it. Alright, here we go. Alright, well, let's get him up to the tables, shall we? <coughs> oh, leftover Olive Garden. It's the best. It's the best. Got him. What did you have from Olive Garden? Chicken Nochi? No, no, no. What is Tour of Italy? Oh, she's just laying down suppressing fire, okay. Okay, let's reload. Lasagna, chicken parmesan. Oh, okay, cool. <gasps> Fuck, I wasted that shot. Oh, 
Fuck, Jaffe, that was a waste. Alright, De Niro, De Niro's going in. He's going in for the kill. I didn't even see him animate, did I miss that? Alright, snipe away. Give me one sec, you guys. That's all she wrote. That's it. Now we gotta go inside and take over the club. Yes, what we get? Yeah. What is this? This is, uh, That's right. Negative status, negative effects, okay. Alright, fellas. Oh, there's Al Capone over there. What's he doing? That's why he's having a war. Oh shit. Come on, let me get in your shit and take over, you fuck. Really? <laughs> Jeez! That's enough. Damn idiots! Oh, these guys are attacking my, uh... They're attacking my place of business. This is not gonna be easy. Alright, no worries. Fuck you. Thank you, Milton Lamb. Good to see you, bud. Alright, fine. You're going down to Chinatown, motherfucker. Not with that weapon, you're not. Shit! Shit! Yeah, yeah. Take them out nice and orderly, one at a time. Come on, don't make that one. That should have done it, no? Okay. All these guys look like they're wearing pandemic masks. Uh, Donald, this is, uh, PvE as far as I know. I do not think there is any multiplayer in this. So you can shoot this guy's kneecaps out. Um, and it damages their shit. So now they're slower. And they won't move as far. Uh-oh. I guess I need to spend money beefing up my, uh my security so when you fight as them they're stronger I mean, they're not bad right now actually but that's a waste of a shot you fucking idiot. <gasps> fuck you Fuck! 
Belial, thanks for, uh, thank, oh shit, this guy's going down. Thanks for, uh, subbing, buddy, over on the YouTube, I appreciate it. Okay, they're putting down suppressing fire. Alright, we in this shit now, motherfucker. <gasps> Maybe we don't. Alright, fuck you. This. this is running gun. You can perform. Okay, cool. So. So I'm gonna run all the way to here. But I now can still perform an action. Thank you, Juan. Thank you, the home of 16 and 32 bit here. I appreciate it, bud. Oh shit, there he goes. Ah, oh, I hate it losing him. Are, are you finding people are still having a problem with Pride Month? Uh, Bukaki, really? Jesus. Incredible. Dude, what is happening? Come on. Is that what they're saying? Where's straight month? Oh, no. I mean, go make straight month. Nobody cares. I mean, straight people aren't historically, you know, murdered and downtrodden and targeted in this country, but sure. That's the same shit with misogyny, too, though. It's like, welcome they It's shit. just it's childish. Fine, fine, fine. Eh, she's good enough. All right, we're gonna take this shit over. Oh, Donald, I just don't know how people are like. I don't know how they function in their worlds, man. Oh, what do I got? Five, six people. Okay, do I have them all? Got it. All right, so no, no, escape. No, I want all my dudes here. Where are all my dudes? Yeah, see, sometimes yes. they get a little lost. Uh, thank you, Joseph. Thank you, Cosmos. Okay. Huh? Hang on. Uh huh. Where's Colson? Hey. What? Talk to me, boss. What do you want? Yes. How many do I got? One, two, three, four, five, six. Right. So if we go attack, no. Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Bukaki, I'm actually looking to hire uh, a producer, or it's actually a part-time producer for the show right now. I haven't really spent any time thinking about it, but uh, but you know, and I don't, I don't imagine. Well. I don't imagine you would need to be local, but you might. Let me, uh, I don't want to, I don't want to promise you anything. Plus, I, I don't know if I could give you what you need because it's not full time yet. But I, here's what I can tell you. I think if I had a producer on the show, 
uh, I would th that producer would pay for his salary relatively quickly because there's a lot of things I don't get to that I want to get to and I simply don't because I'm not organized enough but uh, yeah I mean that's going to happen in the next month or two like we could already have sure. a podcast out there's a guy who's willing to do the podcast for me I get asked all the time it's like dude can you do it on a podcast because that's how I listen to this stuff and I can't keep YouTube open and it's 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 not that it's easy but it's not a big deal. I just haven't had the time to sit down and, you know, get the work done. Um, okay, let's see. How many, I gotta kill, uh, come on. I, you don't wanna walk into a situation though and feeling like you're invincible, right? Am I right? Come on now. Because if I go in here and I start just shooting blindly, we're gonna lose. James Baldock. Good to see you, sir. James Bollock has become a member of the Diet So Soldiers. I appreciate it, buddy. Very nice to see you. Very nice to have you. I hope you're doing well. Good, sir. Where are you hail from, James? Everybody give James whatever emoticon you want to give him. I appreciate it. Um, so, yes. Well, okay. I got to check my text. Let me let you know because Cliff may be tomorrow. Or we may reschedule, which was totally my fault. Let me see if you got back to me yet. Um, okay, here we go. Okay, okay. Yeah, so we are on tomorrow. That is Cliff tomorrow at 3.30 uh, Eastern Time, 12.30 Pacific Time. And uh, he's, we got him for 90 minutes. And I think we'll have a great chat with good Sir Cliff Blazinski. It's going to be good times. All right, well, I'm going to use my sniper rifle on... Let's, let's move her out. I think she can do better damage from here. Don't fuck with my fucking people, motherfucker. I will. Oh, interesting. Hmm. Hello, retired. Hello, acute perspective. Good to see ya. Oh, okay. Let's have her. Uh, let's have her go into Overwatch then. Okay. Let's have this guy die. Oh, you're from Australia, James. Oh, good, man. I'm doing great, man. Thanks for joining. I appreciate it, buddy. What was happening in Australia? I just saw something about Australia um, the other day. It might have been the COVID thing. It might have been talking to uh, Alana Pierce, who's also going to come on the show when she gets back from Australia, because you guys have a really good... Um, you guys have a really good... Um, system over there when it comes to COVID. Like, people come into the country, you've got to quarantine for two fucking weeks, man. I mean, it's... Okay, okay, let's see what happened. Took over the dark side. Okay, so let's see what happened. I think we got all the orange buildings. Okay, we're taking that over. We'll turn this. What is it now? A speakeasy? Now nah, let's make it a brothel. I'm feeling, I'm feeling generous. Okay, this one, in honor of good Sir James, who just joined... We'll call this Bald Baldox. Come on now, you know what I'm doing, James. You know what I'm doing, Baldox Baldcox. Come on, Jimmy J. Come on, Jimmy B. There you go. You got yourself a brothel, sir. Um, system. I think they beat people who go out of their home. Yeah. Am I gonna stream? Fa hey, hello, Spaz. Um, we did. We have streamed Phasmophobia in the past. We can absolutely stream it again. I know they've upgraded it a lot. So yeah, we'll do a uh, we'll do a Phasmophobia stream coming up um, in the next couple of weeks. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so now I want to leave this building because I want to see if I've actually taken over some of these neighborhoods. Okay, I'm on it. <laughs> the party started. Okay, so that's ba ba Baldix, Baldix, Baldcox. Um, 
Okay, hang on. Whoa, no, no. I gotta fight Capone's people? Oh, shit, look at that. Oh, this is just the guard. Fuck him, I don't care, take him. Yeah, I don't give a shit. I, my second COVID jab was, was fine. I was really tired for like a day and a half, two days. And after that, totally good. Okay, so let's see. Bukaki, um, am I uploading the audio? No, this guy who reached out, he watches the stream. He's like, oh, we're gonna, I'll do that for you. So he, he, he'll get the audio, he'll, he'll timestamp it, he'll cut out the dead air and some of the parts that obviously don't really work really well. Um, and then he'll put it up, you know, on like, you know, all the different podcast services via one uh, that we're gonna use. And, you know, we're off to the races. Okay, so let's see, did I, did I get all of the buildings? Let me check my missions, my empire missions. You have self-quarantine in a hotel. Every country should be doing, absolutely. That's exactly right. You goddamn right. You got yourself the best broth. Well, it's not the best brothel in town yet, but don't worry, buddy. I'll make it nice for you. Okay, eliminate a minor faction. Didn't happen. How do I do that? Um, control a neighborhood. I'm working on that. Um, hold 20 rackets. All right, well, let's see what we can do. Okay, all my, all my missions are done except Empire missions at the moment. Yeah, Bukaki, I agree. People have been asking for the podcast for a while. I just haven't had the time. Um, okay. What? Ooh, ooh, cops. What's the cops doing there? Hmm. I'm going to have a sit down with this gangster. Retired says, What I do you think? I don't like how close you've gotten to that boss and their faction. I want you to break off your business arrangement with them. Um, Guitar Hero Harmonix, most fun game was Frequency. Uh, I liked it. I didn't like having all the fucking props and shit, although that obviously made a lot of help. I could consider it if the offer was right. I'll give you some barrels of booze. How about that? Now, fuck you. You're going to, we're going to war. That's the worst offer I've ever heard. Get it. Noted. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goddamn right. Fuck with me. Fuck. You know who the fuck I am? King Kong ain't got nothing on me, motherfucker. All right, what is this? Oh. Okay. Do we want to... Oh. Defeating your exterior guards, the outfit are heading inside. <gasps> they're taking Bukaki's casino! No, they're not. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. This is going to be a close one, boys. Oh, shit. <laughs> All right, guys. Here we go. Assholes. You're goddamn right. All right, let's focus. We can make this work. Goddamn right. Don't fuck with me. Light him up. Fuck off, bitch. They ain't got no chance. Let's shoot him. Let's fucking shoot his dumb ass. Is it like tactics? Um, yeah, so far I wouldn't say it's as smart as that or Jean d'Arc or Fire Emblem in terms of the moment to moment uh, tactics, but um, it makes up for it because it's got all these other systems that are, that are working. So it doesn't really require it to be um, 
that deep, but it's still fun though. Uh. Yeah, uh, Mike will absolutely play with people on the the night for sure. Up. Oh shit! Lost somebody. God damn it, Jaffy, come on. Come on. No, retired gamers, this is all AI. No, no, I didn't want to reload. Ay, ay, ay. All right, fine. God. Oh. <gasps> oh, shit, no. But I've never played Ogre Tactics. I love games like that, though. There we go. Come on, take him out. Call a doc. Fuck you. Why don't you call your mom, motherfucker? And these are, you know, these are Capone's boys. You take out, you know, you take one of his. Okay, okay. Oh shit, he's coming to the bar. Uh, James, I haven't given up on Returnal. I love it, and I'm almost certain I will come back to it. I just, I got busy with a bunch of other things I'm playing and, and prepping for the stream. But no, I, I love it. I But I, I, I haven't beaten the second boss yet. And I just take, I have to be in a certain mindset to do it. And I just got busy with these games and I've kind of fallen out of that mindset. Hmm. Watch out! Last one left, though. There's the lady behind the bar. She's still alive, right? I hope so. Wait, what the fuck? Oh, she's doing suppressing fire. Okay, wait, where's the lady behind the bar? She died? I liked her. She was my pal. All right, you and me, sister, here we go. Careful. She's got how many hit points? And that's not gonna be enough. Okay, so I gotta be smart about this.
so they took over one of my buildings. Fuck these bitches. They took over this one? Oh, you fuckers. Yeah, well, that's... I mean, this guy's got his shit back. Oh, he's in a different neighborhood. Why are we over here? Oh, because I had to sit down with that little fuck. Okay, fine. No worries, pal. This might be bad. All right. Oh, you're an idiot, Jaffy. What are you doing? Don't, don't, don't use the taxi. Use this taxi, idiot. Okay, we're gonna go, we're gonna take the pain to Capone, that little fucker. Here we go. Here we go, you wanna fuck with me? Meyer Lansky? Uh-oh. Oh, these guys declaring war? Not a problem, pal. Shooting! <laughs> Gotcha. Knock him around! Alright. What do we got? Oh yeah, the music in this game, the sound in this game, the ambiance in this game, it's really good. It's The production value is really good. Where are the bad guys? There's one, two... There's only four of you guys? Oh, fuck off. Fine, we're doing this. Alright, let's move my dude to here. Yeah, let's see if we can get anybody. God damn, what's he got? A sniper rifle? Not too shabby, pal. Oh, she's got herself a sniper rifle, though. You know she does. RPG, this was made by uh, Romero Studios, as in John and Brenda Romero. Um, Brenda's done a bunch of games. She worked on Wizardry, Jagged Alliance, uh, Train. Uh, she's done a bunch of great stuff. Um, and then uh, John, obviously, was Doom and Quake and Wolfenstein and all that. And they got married. And now they have a company together. Um... But I knew about this game, Aqua. I just, you know, after... And it was always kind of on my list, but I was like, eh, it's probably not my kind of game because I don't like strategy games. But this is not... I thought this was going to be some boring thing like Tropico, but it's really cool. Um, but this is... Um, uh, it's also on Game Pass. So when I turned on Game Pass and I saw it, I'm like, well, fuck it. And then John... I knew John's coming on the show in a week or two, so... Um, Poison Pin, thank you, buddy. Thank you for joining the... Watch this is for you, Poison Pin. Boom! That's for you, buddy. That's for you, Poison Pin. Uh, Poison Pin, thank you so much, buddy, for joining our uh, little band of Merry Fucksticks. Um, everybody give Poison Pin. I'm going to give him something. Oh, hang on. Hang on. I'm going to give Poison Pin... I'm going to give him a blue waffle. Yeah, it's... Yeah, R Ricardo. XCOM of crime. I mean... I got to be honest, I always found, I'm going to give you a Prozac and Titanic and a heart and a blue waffle and a cake and Thor's hammer. Um, I still haven't really gotten into XCOM. It was a little too complicated for me, um, but I, so I don't know uh, how similar, but I would say that this, it does seem more like XCOM in that there's a lot of other systems at work versus something like um you know, Gears Tactics. Poison Pin, thank you for the super chat, buddy. I appreciate it. You're addicted to crack. You know how I know you're not addicted to crack? Um, here, Here's how I can tell you I know you're not addicted to crack. 
because somebody crack is the crack is the drug that people do um, when they don't have a lot of money. Cocaine is the drug people do when they want the same effect, but they have money. And if you're addicted to crack, there's no goddamn way you're dropping ten goddamn dollars on a fucking stream. You know it, and I know it, sir. Come on now. You got to You got to get up pretty early in the morning to fool Papa Jaffe. That said, though, I appreciate the uh, support, man. Thank you, sir. All right, what do we got? Uh. Evil Within. I want to play Evil Within 2 is what I want to play. I hear Evil Within 2 is a better game. You're free basing crap. Oh! Shoot my dude. She's dead. Yeah, it's good we spent that money because this woman is a badass for that sniper rifle. Thank you, James. Thank you, Aqua. Look at that. Boom. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Ooh. Okay, I want to go take over this building. Where's my cab? Uh, awesome. Thanks for subbing, buddy. Bukaki says, Evil Within 1 was pretty solid. There were some parts I could do without. There was more good than bad. It got me freaked out playing in the dark. That's good. Uh, Metallic Man, thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Um, I, you know, look, I really want to play Evil Within 2, Understood. though, because everyone's raving on that one. Um, where's my... Oh, he's over here. We need that dude. He's the boss. All right. Okay, so we are going to go... Where this is where we're going? Oh sh! Uh, no. Are these a, are these a low end game game game? Fuck it, we're taking this over. Um, the John and Jaffe show. Oh, uh, thank you, Arthur, for seven, buddy. I appreciate it. Nothing ever happened to it. We just never actually formally said we were gonna do it. I'd love to have John back on. He's awesome. All right, this is this is the last fight of the night that I'm taking my kids to the dog park, but I want to kill Al Capone's guys. Uh, it's booming to bustling. The locals want premium over whiskey. You might want to change what you're serving. So shit's getting bad in the neighborhood. It's starting to go down. I think Evil Within 2 is on Game Pass, although I don't think you have Game Pass, do you, Bakaki? All right, let's find a guard. Yeah, these guys... Capone's not gonna be happy. You know what? It's weird how I don't give a fuck about Al Capone being happy. Fuck you, motherfucker. Never stop fighting till the fight is done. Come on. Oh, shit. What are these... What the fuck? I don't give a fuck about these guys. Oh, no. They want to break into my homestead. Okay, well, I gotta kill them now. Why would it not be on Game Pass? Isn't that weird? Isn't it owned by Bethesda? Hmm. Fuck you, RPG. What did Microsoft announce today? I wasn't even aware they announced anything.
Got ourselves a little gang, a little, little, little turf war going on, fellas. I mean, I saw there were there was some art that they announced today. They released some artwork, but it looked okay. I told you guys. Do not fuck with Mr. Zero. I will break you in half. Suppressing fire. Got it. Yeah, big deal. I can take a shot. I can take a shot. The Wild at Heart. The Wild at Hearts is already out. Um. The Wild at Hearts is already out. Backbone and Darkest Dungeon is already interesting. Yeah, I was gonna say those aren't. I mean, Wild at Hearts is great, but I, I Darkest Dungeons is great. I don't know what Backbone is, and for Honor, you know, I mean, I I, I played for Honor. It wasn't for me. Oh, it's for the Cloud. Okay, it's a good game. I don't know, man. I don't see Days Gone getting getting done. I just don't. Ah, <laughs> funny. Twisted Metal 5 concept trailer? No. What is that, man? I've never heard of such nonsense. Seriously, I have no idea what you're talking about. Fuck off! Here's a prediction. Microsoft will show Halo online and announce a beta starting that day. That would be amazing. I think you're going to get Game Pass dropping, um, I said this on Twitter, uh, Psychonauts 2. But Ricardo, I saw your comment to that. You don't agree with me? You don't think they'll drop Psychonauts 2 on uh, Game Pass that same day? Gonna try hard to get an X Xbox. Oh, if they release limited edition, yeah, I, I've loved it. Someone on YouTube animated the main menu. Oh, I've seen that. But you know what's funny about that? I've I've never understood. I've seen people working on that, and I'm just kind of like, you know, the main menu of Twisted Metal Black is pre-rendered. It's a bunch of movie clips, a rendered movie cri clips that are um, put together. Um, and so making it on PS5 is nice that, oh, look, now it's in real time, but the experience is exactly the same. So I'm not quite sure the value of it, but yeah, I, I have seen that. Um, <clears throat> why does it mean it has to launch everywhere? It's Microsoft's game. Why can't they launch it on their system first? Or maybe they will. Maybe they'll sell it digitally for the same day. Um, the design docs for God Award, did anyone ever donate? Yeah, I'm sending three of them out tomorrow, actually.
God of War demo. I wouldn't surprise me. Oh, Maiku, you got it, buddy. Absolutely. I really don't think it would matter, Ricardo. I mean, you may be right. Well, let's put it this way. I don't know what their plans are for E3, obviously, but if these guys don't come up with some things to wow people, as much as I adore uh, Game Pass, it's just, it's, I mean, it, it would be ridiculous. People need to get fired uh, if, if, if it turns out that Xbox's E3 is not really fucking good. I mean, at, at this at this point, that's just kind of ridiculous. All right, can I please attack this building? Why is this so fucking hard? Let me attack it. Yes, go inside. All right. Understood. Okay. Oh, shit. Uh, no, no. See, this is the problem sometimes. I, why would I only want these people with me? I want my guys with me, and now I can't back out. So I have to quit. Let me see if I can load the game. Yeah, five minutes, we'll go. Oh, good, Chongo. I'm so glad it finally arrived. I'm sorry it took so long, dude. You got your copy. Cool. All right, let's see if I want to attack these fuckers. Why do I just have these random dudes? Oh, they're attacking a place of mine. Okay. Okay, let me go kill some people. Like, before I was able to attack him, and I don't know what happened. Let me save them. Outfit. Oh. I'm glad I saved. I'm done. <laughs> all right, fellas, that's it. That's all she wrote. Uh, okay, so listen, tomorrow oops, tomorrow at 3.30 uh, Eastern, we're going to start right on time tomorrow, 12.30 my time, uh, Cliff Blazinski is coming by the show, uh, we are going to do about an hour of him and I just talking, I think I'll turn off the super chats, uh, just because I want to be able to uh, have a focused conversation with them. And then the last 30 minutes, I'm just going to take a bunch of calls, like quick, quick conversations. Uh, Cause I know people want to talk to them, but uh, we only have them for 90 minutes tomorrow and uh, we'll make it a good show. A good conversation. A bunch of people have already emailed me the stuff they want me to ask him. 
you know, my interviews aren't really like that. It's not just question after question. It's more of a conversation, but I'm going to marble some of the ones that are more popular questions into that. It'll be a good talk. I hope to see you. That'll be at 1230 Pacific time tomorrow. Is that right? 12, one, two, three. Yeah. So uh, there you go. So hopefully we'll see you guys tomorrow. If not, we'll see you in the future. Uh, be safe. Take it easy. Thanks for hanging out with